Are you excited? Is this... Is this immediately going to be like... It already looks so good. <laughs> Just everything you remember it being? Oh, yeah. But then... But slightly less pixely. Remastered. <laughs> the hairs on the teddy bear. Where? Oh yeah. How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Two Left Thumbs. My name's Graham. I'm here today with Brett. Hi. We're playing Voodoo Vince, which is an old favorite of Brett's. It's been remastered <laughs> recently. <laughs> uh, it's, I've, I, okay, it's two different ways to start. Who's number one and two? Power you and me. <laughs> <laughs> People like Cosmo the Inscrutable. He tried and failed many times to get his hands on some zombie ghost. And one night, he sent some roaster bots to take it by force. So did the first and second best ones get taken? And that's why it's up to Vince. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be like real people. It's not for the most part. I'm very used to playing games with animals for characters and stuff. Oh. Wow. <laughs> she lives, right? I mean, don't spoil it for me. I was trapped and on my way to Cosmos Lair. The zombie dose his goons had unleashed was already beginning to bend and warp reality. You said the music in this is really good, hey? Yeah, the music's one of the best parts. It was Vince. The zombie dust had brought him to life. An unlikely hero, to be sure. But only Vince can help me now. Is he even aware of what happened, though? He only just gained consciousness like a second ago. <laughs> oh, I see. She's going to guide him. Through weird gypsy powers? Your creator. Find me before it's too late. I am in the clutches of Cosmo the Inscrutable. Remember, you are a voodoo dog. A lot of exposition here. A fair amount. Just beware of evil magic. Cosmo and his monsters can do you great harm. Gather all the zombie dust you can. Defeat all the monsters you can. I will try to help through the link we share, but all depends on you, Vince. Um, okay. <laughs> I didn't know he was going to have a voice. I thought he was going to be a silent character. No, I he's like got a his, lot to say. I like his voice. Okay. Oh, wow, he moves fast. Okay, I've played a lot of, like, 3D platformers and stuff before, so I feel like I should have some familiarity like I should get used to it fairly quickly but ooh, that's a cool move so he can attack things I thought he specifically only could hurt things by him getting hurt yeah like the final you'll see you'll see how it works okay oh, I was hitting the wrong one he's magic I didn't know he was gonna be magic he can't, yeah. he can't really hover forward well. Spin move. I'm way ahead of you. I already did most of this already. <laughs> the first thing you do when you boot up a game is you just start hitting buttons, right? Yeah, oh, I guess no. so. The big one was difficult. Is that the zombie dust? Is that what I'm collecting? I'm not sure. 
<laughs> collecting things was of no concern as a kid. I wasn't. How old was I when this came out? I think it said it was. Oh, I don't even. I can't even remember now. Oh, 20, 2002 or three. So I would have been. I probably would have been like twelve when I got it. Yeah. Twelve or thirteen. Oh wait, that's old enough to like. Evil doers beware. <laughs> oh god. Those were aggressive pokes. And it didn't even kill everything. Or are they in the middle of dying? It was just very it was much more dramatic deaths than I was expecting. Oh, one of them got away. I can't allow that. I think the zombie dust might be whoops. Might be the that one, the little the little blue swirly looking thing. I don't know what all the purple orbs are. Or perhaps that stuff in the corner. Ah. Yeah, I better remember to backtrack. There's a bunch over there. Is this the inscrutable? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Crumulos? I don't remember what his name was. Co Cosmo. <laughs> Crumulos. <laughs> How are you, how is he already aware that he's being opposed? Vince hasn't really done much yet. I think if you're he doing something bad, you pretty much just assume someone's gonna oppose you. I suppose. But do they have the wherewithal to realize that they're the bad guys? It's hard to say. <laughs> Seems like all he did was punch some frogs. <laughs> he just gave it like a gym from the office, quick camera stare. Yeah. Perform like a Three Stooges routine in their <laughs> hologram thing. <laughs> oh, don't poke yourself in the eye. Looked like he was going for the eye. Don't do it, Vince. It's gonna gross me out. I didn't expect Vince to have so much attitude. <laughs> doesn't seems like he doesn't really want to be doing this. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Was there more stuff downstairs? Should I have explored down here more? Ah, I almost missed some bags. Anyways, I thought I didn't. Ex I, th I thought Vince would be like happy to be a hero, like, oh, I gotta go save my creator, and I thought he would be silent. Nope, he's like a sassy grump. <laughs> I like it. I'm liking his attitude. This is a cool. This is cool, like looking game. Cool aesthetic overall. Yeah. I think, I don't think you have played Psychonauts? Mm, I don't think so. There's like a specific level of Psychonauts that this reminds me of. Because that game changes up a lot. It probably would have came out around the same time too. Same like style of game. You'd probably really like Psychonauts. <laughs> what are these guys? Why are they squished flat? Ah! Are they candy? He's a they look like cookies. Yeah, he's like a weird half tree, half gingerbread man. It's like someone, someone's gingerbread cutout thing was broken, and so then they couldn't make a perfect gingerbread man. They had to do the last part by hand. Oh, it's making more. Oh, I see. I can't do it yet. Well, then I think I'm just gonna leave. Because those guys are gonna kill me. I don't think I can fight them endlessly. 
This is the point. Am I? Do you remember? Am I just supposed to keep fighting them? Yeah, that's the first puzzle. I don't know if how many how many hints I want to give you. Oh, you want me to just? Uh, this is work also. Through? It's like the easiest puzzle, I think. Hmm. Oh well, if I I f I forgot that the whole point is that I'm trying to hurt myself. That looks like I hurt myself too much. <laughs> oh no, that was a good thing. That was supposed to happen. Okay. I knew I was supposed to hurt myself. Go get the things. It was he he was stopped for half a second there. I knew I was supposed to hurt myself, but like completely obliterating myself didn't seem like the right course of action. Right. Pressing Y can make you lift some objects. Um Where am I trying to take this to? Oh. Down there, I think, probably. With the other stacks of flour. You, do you remember this? Like, yeah. when you say when you say you don't want to give me hints, is it secretly that you don't remember, or is it? No, I remember this part. I know exactly where in the game I used to get like get stuck. Okay. Oh, there we go. I was wondering why that seemed like I did it just totally fine before. I thought I was I I thought I was trying to put the flower on the mark, not yeah. Uh, voodoo icons. Oh, there it is. Anvil hat. Is it going to explain to me what that is? Do I get to know? Do I just do I just do this better now? I don't know. <laughs> is this another I thing? I don't know what to tell you. The thing I'm most impressed with with this game so far is that it hasn't frozen and shut off yet, which was a thing that mine did back on the original <laughs> Xbox. Oh, really? Yeah. I always thought that with like console games, because it was built for the console, that that wasn't very common. Yeah, I don't know whether it was our Xbox or this game in particular, but... A scratched up disc or something? Uh, it shouldn't have been. I think we got it brand new. Hmm. <laughs> Took a lot out of him. <laughs> I'm just kind of exploring the area a little bit. Some neat things to look at. J. J. Johnson... Unnatural food flavoring. What what do you think they're flavoring it with? <laughs> hey, this is meant for me. <laughs> In what way though? Peculiar that someone would paint something for me. Yeah, the aesthetic of this game is definitely monster ever. First thing I gotta do is wake him up if I wanna get past. Oh, it's another puzzle. Oh, I actually, yeah, I figured. <laughs> I actually do have a health bar. Um, I don't want to just jump down off of here, I don't think. But maybe, oh, there we go. There's a way down. <laughs> I, I was bound to find it eventually, I suppose. I gotta go get that. See how precise my jumping is. No! Darn. Ah! a tough one. It takes three hits to kill that guy. Mm -hmm. Now I've opened up all sorts of different areas to explore. I feel like I was on a very linear path and now all of a sudden I got all sorts of things going on. Oh! So it's just gonna change how I kill myself from time to time? Ooh, yeah. Is that an extra life? Like if I die then... There you go. <laughs> Thanks Brett. <laughs> You're welcome. Thanks for filling me in on that one. Oh, oh the head the head slammer is way stronger than the it's his spinning move. Much more effective. Mm-hmm. That guy looks interesting. He's like a friendly crocodile trucker. I wanna go make friends with him. I'll save that for a next time thing. It might be a bad guy, it's probably a bad guy, but I am curious and want to go try Only one and... way to find out. Ooh. <laughs> Cliffhangers. 